go eat called um, Miss Portland. And apparently it sometimes has up to a three hour wait. Um, <laughs> just chasing her trying to cross the street. And uh, today it only has a 45 minute wait. So we're, we're down for the wait. We're gonna go in because apparently this place is amazing. So we're gonna go try that out on our way out of Portland into New Hampshire. just scared the crap out of the kids because we <laughs> pulled the car over so fast just so we could get out and take pictures. Pretty pretty. It was very, it's very pretty. So here's the truth about taking the New Hampshire drive through the leaves, through, through the White trees, Mountains. through the White Mountains um, National Forest. It is literally a parking lot and okay. has been for a very long time. So you get, at least you get to have lots of chance to look at the leaves. They're very pretty. They are very pretty. And some people are, it seems like this is normal because some people are kind of celebrating it. Like they're... Hanging out their window. Hanging out their um, sunroofs and taking pictures. And so they seem to be in good spirits. They've got their music blasting. Some people even brought their old cars. Yes, there were some There were some really cool vintage cars that were going through here, like doing their horns and stuff. So this must be sort of the thing. Wow. Oh, the dogs had The dogs. <laughs> <laughs> That's so cute. <laughs> It wasn't what we were expecting. It wasn't part of our plan for today. So we may have to put off some stuff. Yeah. We wanted to go hiking and um, go see some covered bridges today, but- We're running out of daylight. Yeah, <laughs> it's, gonna, <laughs> it's gonna, we only have 6.8 miles to go to get to the town that we're gonna be staying in. And um, it might be dark when we get there. <laughs> so, yeah, so far. But that's okay, we're on vacation. 10 minutes for every 100 feet. Yeah, so we are, just enjoying the ambiance and um, hopefully nobody will have to go to the bathroom anytime soon. We saw a sign that said um, beware of moose crossing and then underneath the sign it said hundreds of collisions and I'm like oh <laughs> serious moose crossing okay so um, yeah so we're, we're kind of although I cannot think of a single moose in their right mind who would try to cross in this mess but you know it'd but be kind of nice to see one. Cool watch. Yeah. <laughs> a car and a moose, a car would lose. For sure, 100% that oh, moose would win. <laughs> Since we're sitting here, maybe it's a good time to talk about Is it? the last thing we did, which was breakfast. <laughs> this was not in the travel guide. So we stopped at this place called Miss Portland for breakfast and it was a little diner and it was actually really good. It was, I mean, it wasn't as good as Red's. Like we, we went to Red's in Salem and I still dream about that food. That food was amazing. Um, and th But this place was um, said to be very, very busy and um, everybody liked it and it was very busy. But, um, and it was good. It wasn't something I'll dream about. It'll. Um, it was good though, and the service was good. But um, the point was we were gonna get, have breakfast and then um, come out here to Lincoln, which is where we're staying in Lincoln? No, no. where are we staying? Um, Littleton. Littleton, okay, so in Lincoln, apparently the road splits and we were gonna take the road that had the um, covered. covered bridges and a couple of waterfall hikes on it, little short ones. Um, and that was gonna split and take us to Littleton. We, it was supposed to be a two and a half hour drive. We're about four hours into it right now. I feel like Gilligan. <laughs> yeah, it's not, um, and we're not even, 
Well, it says that we have 4.6 miles yeah, to the next lie. turn, but it's taken us 40 minutes to go one mile. So it says that we'll be there in 24 minutes, but it's a lie. It's been saying it was 36 minutes for the longest time. So anyway, so we've spent the whole day in the car, which has been fun. Um, but the leaves are beautiful and uh, very nice. We've got a couple of funny stories. We saw a lady get out of a car literally just like a boss got out of her car went over and over to a van and just dropped trow and peed right next to that van got right back in her car and <laughs> like she's done this a thousand times um so that was fun but and we could totally see her or at least i could i just closed my eyes um she didn't seem to care so anyway we're still here yep see you tomorrow the highway still be here so yes it's getting dark um, we will probably we're starting to get hungry again, which is weird because it feels like we just had breakfast but um, and we've burnt zero calories because we've been sitting in the car. So um, we will probably do our hikes and our bridges. We, we will go up to Littleton. There's a greenway hike right there in town. So we will go do that in the dark probably because it'll probably be dark. But um, and then tomorrow we will come back down and see you're coming back this way. I don't know. We'll see. I don't know if I want to come anywhere near this mountain ever again. It's a beautiful mountain. It's a beautiful mountain. I highly recommend it if you're doing it by drone yeah. or by helicopter. But I don't think a car is the way to go. Even a bike would be better than this. Oh yeah, so we were kind of like laughing because the cyclists were, um, you know, they're coming up the mountain and they're going super slow. And I'm like, oh dude, that would suck. I would That would kick my butt. And then it, when we've been sitting here, <laughs> doing nothing for like half an hour that bike just went sailing by and you know he's just like ah. Woohoo! <laughs> now i'm going faster than all y'all here we sit oh my god this is ridiculous <laughs> i keep i keep trying to just embrace it and go oh look how pretty the leaves are but when you've been looking at the same tree for like 20 minutes you're like oh maybe a different tree would be a good thing to look at if I saw a moose, that would make it all worth it. Rampaging moose. <laughs> that a guy jumped out of the van that's like four cars ahead of us to um, use the bathroom in the woods and we were sitting here forever so he probably felt like he was safe but then we just went like a mile <laughs> and the dude's still in the woods <laughs> we're all like oh man uh, the, the door on the van that he came out it's of it's still, still open, open. <laughs> maybe they're hoping he'll like jog and like jump in that would be funny we want to get our steps in so that we're not just sitting in the car. But I'm not even counting my steps. I just wanted out of that damn car. Oh my gosh, it smells so good out here. Yes, it, it smells does. like oh, it smells like fall. Um Did they go by us yet? No, they're right there. I think it's a bad sign when we all start yelling at each other because Chase has to go to the bathroom and uh, Bailey just busted out all the snacks that we had. So I think that we are um, losing confidence in getting anywhere anytime soon. Brian's super grumpy. Say hi, Brian. I just keep myself. <laughs> oh God, don't die. <laughs> Jesus. Nope, that's just Bailey. Oh my God, that's beautiful. Beautiful. <laughs> that is a nice shot. Oh my God, Bailey, get back she's, in the she's car. She's fine. <laughs> she's fine. Just keep going five miles out. Uh. <laughs> that's why she's my favorite child. Hey! <laughs> Listen, I have no problems with oh. this. <laughs> <laughs>
Did you get the shot? <laughs> I got like 12 shots. Okay. To make sure. That's the most My important shoe came part. came untied as well during that time, so I could have died. Ah! <laughs> overcoming strife. <laughs> still a little grumpy but we none of us have to go to the bathroom anymore we're on the open road traffic is less i got some swedish fish things are looking up Yesterday was rough. We um, had a hard time. <laughs> Once we got into town, things started looking up um, pretty fast because we noticed that this is probably the cutest town we've ever seen in our trip yeah, so for far. Sure. Like just adorable little town. And we had a fantastic dinner at this great little restaurant where they had blankets to put on your laps and there was like um, heaters, outdoor heaters mm -hmm. going and it was so cool. Beautiful churches, church bells this morning. And it's just so cute. Like there's little lanterns everywhere. Everybody's super nice. Yeah. It's like, yeah. it's almost like kind of like Stars Hollow from Gilmore Girls. It's like, but it also reminds you of just a tiny bit of every small town in every Halloween horror movie you've ever seen. Yeah. So, um, <laughs> but that's for us, that's good. <laughs> that makes me happy. So um, we are right now at the covered bridge mm -hmm. and um, this is just one of the many, many really cool sites here. But um, I'll show you around. You want to show them around? Sure. Welcome to Littleton. bridge is kind of funny because most of the buildings in this town were built in the 1800s our hotel was 1864 was it? Something like that. There, yeah. and this covered bridge that looks like it's super old was built in 2004 2004 <laughs> but I love it it's just the thing they needed to add on mm -hmm. and that cute little red building over there with the mill that's where we had dinner last night and it was so nice mm -hmm. well done Thank you. 
even the crosswalks are cute. sure if I lived here I would live in the orange house at the end of the suspension bridge because that just screams me.